Hello friends, it's Shara and we have a box opening. I am very excited as this is another one of my three times as a charm. Um, I have purchased this doll twice before. Um, it's one that I really wanted in my collection and I just, they didn't work out the first two. Uh, they just weren't the texture that I can, um, you know, work with very well. And I've been much more diligent about really checking for that. Um, I had never really realized why um, some came one way and some came another. And I'm just have done a little more research into it and now I, I know a lot more. So let's get to it. I'm so excited. This is from, I think her nursery name is Alicia's Little Angels. Um, I bought the baby off of Reborns.com and Alicia is a wonderful artist and I was super, super excited. Um, I went online and I saw her and scooped her up. I was like, I am not even hesitating <laughs> because I do also know that Alicia's dolls go really fast. So, oh, look at how lovely this is packaged. So nice. Ah, oh, beautiful. Let's get tissue. Beautiful box. Look at this beautiful iridescent um, box with a ribbon. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, I love that. All right, let's see. Oh, how lovely. She has a magnetic pacifier. Yes, it is a girl. <laughs> a magnetic pacifier. Pixie is right back behind the box. You probably won't be able to see her until I uh, take um, the box away. Oh, isn't that a beautiful headband? I don't think I saw this on the photos. Beautiful with a pearl and some rhinestones. And this gorgeous, gorgeous marigold yellow. I love this yellow. Beautiful. So pretty. And then there is one of the, um, I love these ones that have the little suede bows. It's just a nice, sweet, simple bow. And I love them. And then I love these um, easy, soft, um, bands. They are great. This doll has painted hair, but they're also great for um, rooted hair. They're a lot less um, harsh on their heads. Oh my goodness. Do you see these little bands? Oh my goodness. Let me make sure you guys can see up there. Aren't those the cutest little bands? They look like little jeans. They're little leggings or yeah, little leggings, so cute. Oh, I love this yellow so much. It's such a pretty color and this baby's skin tone um, and hair color will just look beautiful with this color. Very nice onesie. And then a pair of comfy squishy socks. These are my favorite socks. Very sweet. A pair of um, beautiful dusky pink and a peachy pink and black and gray um, hand mitts. Very pretty with a nice pink trim. Oh, look, this comes with a little cardigan. Oh my gosh, is this not the sweetest little outfit? Oh, I love it. It's got these beautiful um, this, this golden yellow color, um, flowers, and then a, a denim blue that matches perfect with the, um, leggings. Oh, that is just a sweet little outfit. And I love these cardigans that are made with cotton instead of the, 
um, polyester. They're much nicer. It's what I would buy for my real kids and grandkids versus um, the polyester fleecy ones. This is beautiful. Thank you so much, Alicia. All right. So I think I will grab baby now and put her on the podster. Let me get this pretty box out of the way. Yeah, I'll get her out and put her on the podster. We'll be right back. Okay, friends, I know that was just a second for you. Can you see Pixie's little ears sticking out? There's her little nose. Oh, there's both ears. I'm trying to get her to come over here, but she's just uh, just behind the podster. And <laughs> that looks so cute. Pixie, come here. Come here. Oh, I did the good girl. We got a baby. Come lay down. Come lay down with mama. Come on. Come on, baby girl. Come on, lay down. No, that's just fuzz. Come on. It's just from the box. Come on, lay down. Oh, your eyes are dirty. Mama will wipe them when we're done. Oh, there you go. Okay, lay down. Let's look at this new baby. Oh, you guys can't even see her over there. There she is. Pixie. Oh, you see the new baby? You see the new baby? Oh, nice baby, huh? <laughs> All right, lay down. We're going to open the baby. Yeah, I think she's going right back to her spot to lay down. <laughs> Maybe you'll see her. There you go. She's going to lay right there. All right, so we will get to baby now. I Baby was wrapped beautifully with um, bubble wrap, and I went ahead and removed that just need to find the end. I like this blanket. Again, it's cotton. I much prefer cotton. It's very pretty in the yellow and the blue and dusky pink. It all matches with all of the other things we received. Oh, there's a hand. Right away, we see a hand. Baby does have a um, diaper on her head oh my goodness this outfit is just precious so you may know who this is like i said i have had this baby twice this one is a little different than the other two and i'll explain that later but she is wearing little pants look at this little outfit you guys it's little um footed uh pants and then a side uh, snap t-shirt but it's got these beautiful little rainbows super pretty super pretty and she has nice beautiful painting look at that oh my goodness very newborn um red hands beautiful very beautiful so i am now that we've seen the outfit i am gonna take baby's pants off and let you see these chubby little legs so the reason she is a little different is this one has the full body plate it's actually yeah it's um and i don't believe it's removable it's on permanently um but there is a cloth body underneath, so baby is still cuddly. Um, and I wanted that, um, um, well, I just wanted that. <laughs> I don't know how to explain it. Look at those legs. Do you see the chub in this baby? Oh my goodness. <laughs> you may know who this is. And um, now I wasn't really able to work with um, Phoenix's um, uh, full body plate, but that was because he was bigger and it was just so hard for me. But she's a little doll. She's pretty little. And I think, um, in fact, I think she can even wear preemie size. I didn't notice if 
the clothes were creamy. They looked um, like newborn, yeah. Because she is chubby, but she is a small doll. She's only like 17 inches. So, oh my gosh, and she has the tummy plate. We'll take her, um, we'll, I'll, I'll strip her down and show you um, everything once we reveal her face. Oh my goodness, it's so cute. I cannot wait. Oh, I love it. I've never felt like that before. Um, Phoenix didn't quite feel like this. All right, here we go. <laughs> she is painted so well. Here we go. Oh my goodness. Let's see who this is. Let's see. Oh, Alicia, she's wrapped so beautifully. Thank you. Oh, I love the style she's in. Here she is, you guys. It's Meadow. Oh my goodness, she is beautiful. She is so beautiful. She's got these really beautiful long lashes and these gorgeous green eyes. Oh my goodness, they remind me so much of my first meadow that had green eyes. Um, they were called glass green. Um, Alicia called these newborn green, I believe. Oh my gosh, and look at her painted hair, you guys. Unbelievable, Alicia does amazing hair. All right, I have to give you a cuddle, baby girl. Oh, she is so cute. Oh my goodness. I'm actually going to take off her cardigan so you guys can see her body plate. Oh. Okay, baby girl, you ready to make your, your debut? <laughs> Here she is. Look at her. Oh my gosh, that little chubby tummy. She has a little birthmark here on her arm. Oh, she is so cute. Her lashes are so long. I'm going to bring you in so you guys can see her gorgeous eyes. Oh, sorry, guys. Let me see if I can sit her up. A little bit more. Let's put your arms down. There you go. So she is the Meadow by Andrea Arcello, and there are only 1,500 of them made. I'm gonna turn her around and show you. <clears throat> Let me take you out. I want to show you guys her back because you can see the full body. Uh, plate. She has a bone. <laughs> I'm going to give you a pat pat. <laughs> Isn't that cute? <laughs> Just love it. Oh, she has another birthmark. Oh, I love it. So beautiful. I mean, I love her little chubby tummy. Isn't that the cutest little thing? Oh, let me show you her COA. She is the Meadow, oh, and I have her name, Meadow by Andrea Arcello. She is number 1196 out of 1500. Beautiful COA. I have three names picked out, and I don't think I'm going to give her all three, but that is always a... Um, an option because well she's my doll right <laughs> so i really love the name abilene and it means meadow or from the land of meadows and i like to use their sculpt name in the name i choose for them so i love the name abilene and i love the nickname abby a lot and then i'm definitely using pamela either as the first name or a middle name. It means honey or sweet. 
And so I want her name to mean like sweet meadow or from the sweet meadow, from the honey meadow, something to that line. But I also really love the name Kinley, K-I-N-L-E-Y. And Kinley means royal meadow. So I am torn if I should do Pamela Abilene, Abilene Pamela, Pamela Kinley, or Kinley Pamela. So I would appreciate your guys' advice. I love when you leave your comments and give me your opinion on which names you prefer. Um, so that's either the first name Abilene or Kinley, or the first name Pamela, or it would be the middle name Pamela with Abilene or Kinley. So Pamela is a certain, um, because even if it's her first name, I love the nickname Pammy. Um, I, I just love that name and the fact that it means honey or sweet really, um, I think fits her because she is just a sweet little, uh, beautiful, um, little nugget there. <laughs> And I am torn between Kinley and Abilene. So you guys will have to let me know. And I appreciate it. All right, guys. Well, this was short and sweet, just like sweet baby here. <laughs> and I hope you're all having a wonderful day. And we will see you in the next video. As always, friends, we're sending you wishes of love and light. Take care, everyone. Bye.